I thought I knew and I do not. Arguably, these came out of the exact same plant and put into a different bag and box because these taste identical. Can your taste buds tell the difference between the generic and the name brand? You know, I'd like to think that I'm cultured enough that my tongue could do the job. I don't think so. And in today's challenge, we're going to be doing seven rounds of generic versus name brand cereals. Oh. Fun fact, you notice the cereal companies that made up the lie that breakfast is the most important meal of the day? What? Yeah. Look at them! <laughs> What? I heard it somewhere, looked it up, and I was like, son of a gun, they got me. I don't know if I can press forward now. Right? Now you just hate cereal. It's all a lie, a sham, a bamboozle. Can we taste the difference between the generic and the name brand? I always like the generics better. Do you? Yes. Because, Are you sure? Yes. Well, okay, I guess we'll find out if I'm for sure, for sure. But my logical thinking is they're a little more lax on their quality control. So things usually end up a lot sh more sugary. Cereal's a sham, cereal's a sham, it's all a lie to sell their food. Round one. Hold on, hold on, hold what on. What we, oh, there's more. Yes. Okay, okay. I already know. Whoa, how do you know? I mean, we start. You start left or right? What's the cinnamon toast crunch thing where they say that you can see the difference? Probably just their commercial. I, but I feel like there's a saying. Oh, that's yummy. <laughs> wow. Okay. So I feel like I can see the difference. I can. I feel like I can see which one is the generic off the mm -hmm, bat. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But does it taste better? Oh, it's the taste you can see. Isn't that oh, cinnamon yeah. toast crunch? I mean, I feel like we need to be blindfolded for this. Because <laughs> if you didn't know, like say you were completely <clears throat> blindfolded, you didn't have visuals. But I mean, what, how often do you blindfold yourself and eat your food? But would you be able to tell? Yes. Really? Yes. Really? Yes. This one's more cinnamony, but this one's more whole. This one's, this, I know which one it is. I don't know, man. We might be in for a shocker. Which one do you think is the name brand Cinnamon Toast Crunch? Ah, did you see that sneak? Yeah, you that. had me tricked. I thought you were going no, for that one. No, because clearly it's the left one. But be honest, does oh, this it taste one taste better? better? Does it really to mm -hmm. you? Why? More cinnamon. That's your only reasoning? Why else would I eat cinnamon toast crunch? Because of the toast. I don't want crunch? it to taste toasty. Well, Let you guys taste. are correct. Ah! Starting this off strong. I'll be honest though, like, is it really worth paying the difference? I don't know. This one's pretty good. <clears throat> Call me crazy, but I honestly think these, whatever these are, are great. You're crazy. You told me to do it. <laughs> Round two. Oh, dang. This one's going to be harder. Don't look at it. Don't look at it. You're not allowed to look. You can't tell the difference. <laughs> yeah, you can. No, you can. These look exactly the same. Fruity Pebbles. You know, they're kind of just like miniature frosted flakes or squished Rice Krispies with color. Don't you dare break my heart right now. I mean, just look at it. Don't you dare. I'm going. I'm going. I haven't told you to shut up in two weeks. <laughs> <laughs> you can't even put that in the same realm as Rice Krispies. It's because you can't eat Rice Krispies without a pound of sugar. I am flabbergasted. You don't know? I don't know. I think I know. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. But it's also been a while. You know what's funny? Do you think that a lot of the kids eating Fruity Pebbles today even know who the Flintstones are? Now here's the problem. They probably I'm having. think they're the mascot for the cereal. <laughs> You've got a point. I don't know, man. I think it's obvious. Clearly obvious. However, I do think they taste comparable. You know what I mean? All right. Mm. Which one do you think is name brand? Correct. You think? Oh yeah. Incorrect. Oh. What? No way! What? The colors in this one are so much more vibrant and beautiful, and the taste is better. Like a lot. Get out of here, for real. Like way better. This? This has a fruity taste, the other one does not. It's just like a, a hint of it. It's like the LaCroix of friggin' cereals. It's like they poured a bowl of fruit and then put a fan and just yep. blew the taste of fruit yep. out of your- Yep, that's exactly what they did. 
No way. This is a generic? Yep, that is the Malto Meal Dino Bites. Do not ever buy Fruity Pebbles again. You Dude, can just buy Dino this. Bites all day. <laughs> Round three. Well, I thought this one was gonna be a dead ringer, but now. Crunch berries. I am not so sure. Oh my goodness. This one's got a lot more berries. That's the only thing I'm noticing so far. The colors are always close, but just a little bit off. I thought I knew and I do not. Arguably, these came out of the exact same plant and put into a different bag and box. Cause these taste identical. Legitimately what identical. The heck, dude? <laughs> I think I know. All right, which one is the name brand Crunch Berries? I don't know. Are you gonna try and split the difference? I think, I think. You think that's the one? I do. I don't I don't think so. And here's my reason. The only reasoning, the yellow Color. things are bigger. They're bigger? Yeah. And I don't Sam. remember them oh, being that Sam. big. That's the only thing I'm going off of. I don't I do not remember as a kid them being this big. I don't know. Austin is correct. Yes! Okay. <laughs> I was going with the color. It was a little more bright and vibrant. Wow. Interesting. Round four. All right, so this one is Lucky Charms. If oh. you look closely, it's a dead giveaway, so. So don't look. No oh, looking, oh, no looking. I'm gonna look you guys dead in the eyes the entire round and I will eat them blindly. You'll never get me Lucky Charms. What's the fake one? Isn't that like marshmallow mateys? I thought I knew. Yep. No, I don't. I mean, I think I might know. Get out of here, you know. There ain't no way you know. I gotta say I know. Is, what do you mean? No what? way, we're voting separate? All right, so. No, oh, no. Now, <laughs> take a close look. Oh, no. <laughs> Cam! Gosh dang it! <laughs> Austin is correct again. You yeah. voted so early, you were so confident. It's because if I just keep eating, then they blend together and taste the same. <laughs> I will say the marshmallow does, it's got that taste. Now that doesn't mean, doesn't mean it's necessarily better. If I'm being honest, the generic, the marshmallow has a better marshmallow taste. I was only it's more looking, sugary. I was only looking to find the name brand. That doesn't mean that it's better. I think I actually am partial to the generic, if I'm being honest. Round five. So you've gotten one out of five, right? <laughs> no, one out of four. What is this? What do you think it is? It's not life, is it? No. Is it life? Golden grams. I don't need this crap. <laughs> Damn. What? What? Yeah, have you ever had golden grams? I don't know. They're delicious. Prepare for your world to be rocked, my good okay. sir. Okay. Wow, coming in here all high and mighty. What's this? This is crap. This looks like fr Wait, friggin'. Men try looks golden like grams for the first time in their life ever. <laughs> You're witnessing it here first. <laughs> Cheers, amigo. I don't know if this is golden grams. Great, you made me make a mess. <laughs> Mmm. These ones taste better. Way better. <laughs> okay. So whatever's on this side definitely tastes way better. These ones are more colorful, a lot more rigid. Like their, their lines are far more pronounced. These ones, you can actually see the sugar, which is not a bad thing in my book. I don't know, but I have logic. <laughs> What's your logic? These ones are better looking. They're more precise. They're more mm. presentable. And hopefully, if I'm correct, it goes along with my theory that These those are made with sugar. the generic ones are more lackadaisical in their making of the cereal. I will agree, but these taste far superior. They do taste better. Which is shocking. You guys are right. That one is uh -huh. the name brand. And it sucks. On the right. <laughs> this is garbage. <laughs> this is. Rock this is... my world. <laughs> Rocked me back into not ever wanting to eat it again. But this is so good, right? This one's good. <laughs> way, way better. <laughs> Round six. Russell Sapovs. <laughs> <laughs> what? Russell Sapovs. <laughs> Russell Sapovs. 
Ooh, I thought I would be able to tell. Oh, I gosh. Cannot. I was never a fan of Reese's Puffs. Get out of here! I don't like cereal that much. So oh. I was never in way into a lot of them. But I mean, you can't deny that they're good. Some of them are. I just hated how quickly they'd get mushy and gross. And how much time you got in the mornings? Oh, friggin' They're was... called breakfast I was a kid in the 90s. You we had all the time in the world, man. bro. It was the you peak of our humanity. <laughs> This is a peak of our society. Did you wake up early on your school days? I know I sure didn't. I had my my schedule down to the minute. <laughs> like, if I slept into 7.05, I knew I wasn't doing my hair that day. Are we talking high school or are we talking uh, elementary? I ate this stuff through high school. I don't know if I ate breakfast in high school. What? I didn't have time. You, you woke, woke up, up that seven, late? Yeah, you woke up at 7.05. <laughs> I woke up at 7.40, had to be there at 7.45. And I did it. <laughs> I was hoping, not paying attention, it would just hit me in the face and say, this one's the one, but. I don't like how it makes my teeth feel. That's how I feel about the Lucky Charms. The marshmallows make me cringe. Mm. Wow, these taste identical. At this point, you're literally going off of sight because they taste the exact same. <laughs> Austin is. <laughs> Correct. Yeah! <laughs> I'll be honest though, it's only because I was guessing. <laughs> Final round! Hmm. Man, those are pretty. <laughs> those are chonky. Those are some chonky boys. <laughs> I like them big. I like them chonky. Chonky! For loops. I know which one the name brand is. Is it? That one? Are you sure? <laughs> no, put yours back! It slipped. I dropped it on accident. Don't trust me. Go again. How are you gonna gain any points on me if you just vote for me? Vote with I don't, me. If you're voting, if, if you're the right, then I don't gain any points either way. <laughs> what? <laughs> it's a wash, is what he's trying to say. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right, you guys are. You're correct. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I, again, though, I gotta say. That was my initial thought. But colors, that was... sizes, and taste all better on the generic. The generic also has six grams more added sugar per serving. That's why it's better. That's why it's better. It's more round. They are Your real. whole round is loops. Why are your loops like chunky? If you don't mind the added sugar, man, it's hard to argue to go for name brand because you're really saving is. money <clears throat> and it tastes better. You get a giant, you know, the boxes nowadays are like this big, not even two inches. They're ridiculous. They're so tiny. And they're expensive. Jeez Louise. Well, there you have it. Seven up, seven down. Go generic all day. I'm gonna mix these, eat them all, because I don't really care. Cereal's delicious. You know, this doesn't stop with just cereal. It's usually the case most of the time. You don't need that new Gucci purse. Just go buy the Fucci from the dude on the street, on the corner of the street. 10 bucks looks the same, made from the same stuff. Probably came from the same freaking factory. <laughs> Uh, well, let us know down in the comments what you think, if there's a generic that you prefer over a name brand, or if you're a purist, if you like the name brand <laughs> over the generic. But you gotta tell us why, because and it better just be compelling. <laughs> for wanting to spend more money on food is not an accurate reasoning, in my opinion. Huge thanks and shout out to all of our members for supporting us. It's because of you that we get to do dumb stuff like this. So thank you so much. We love you, we thank you, and we'll see you next time. Namaste. Bye! Deuces. When did you start yoga? Mm, last week. <laughs> <laughs> How have you not gotten any milk on the table? Because <laughs> I'm a clean eater, man. Cereal's a sham. Cereal's a sham. It's all a lie. To sell their food. It's all a lie. A sham. A bamboozle. Makes you want to kill it. <laughs> Makes you want to kill breakfast. Makes you want to become a Serial killer! killer.